we're mentioning COVID-19 in terms of your development of a vaccine, but you've been focused as well on solid tumors, on a vaccine for rabies. Why even bother with COVID given Moderna, which also employs mRNA technologies ahead of you, as are so many other companies? Why not focus on what you've been focused on? Well, thank you very much, first of all, for having me. Um, the focus is clearly to make the best out of the mRNA technology. We are around in the mRNA technology now for 20 years, founded in 2000. And this is a unique opportunity for us to make a difference, to show that this technology platform is able to transform really the medicine, quick and fast development of a vaccine, which is safe, tolerable, and then efficacious which secures, and, and that's exactly what RNA is all about. Right. Although we should point out, and this has come up with Moderna, to date, no product that u utilizes mRNA as a ther therapeutic or prophylactic vaccine has been approved in the United States or Europe. Isn't that correct? Yeah, that's absolutely correct. But this is what innovation does. It starts somewhere, and then the first product will soon come. And um, we, we are planning to have our product in the market in the mid of next year. That's pretty fast, and we can produce it. Yeah, tell me about manufacturing, because that obviously figures very prominently into all company strategies. What are you doing in terms of manufacturing? What advances, if any, do you bring to the market? Well, we have started with the manufacturing of mRNA on a GMP grade already 2006, because we wanted to start a clinical trial uh, at the time, and uh, there was no GMP manufacturing available. So this is what we are doing. And two years ago, we started with an industrial scale facility. Nobody has been thinking about that this pandemic outbreak would be um, uh, triggering such a request uh, of such supply. So therefore, we know exactly how to produce it and also to broadly produce it. And then together with our vaccine, where we have got only a very low dose as a single digit microgram, which is one, gram, one microgram is one millionth part of a gram. And this translates into manufacturing. This provides already quite a few doses. Uh, the German government owns a significant stake in your company. Does that obligate you if you are successful in terms of developing a vaccine for the virus in providing it only to uh, Germans? No, no, not at all. So this investment is really an equity investment like any other investor as well. And certainly is saying, well, this is technology out of Germany, but for the entire world. But it's just an equity investment and to develop the company rather than just a COVID vaccine. Uh, and finally, what are you going to do with the money? This is not being sold secondarily, right? You are raising the money directly as well. What are you going to do with it? Well, it's already dedicated. Uh, as you said in the beginning, we are working in the prophylactic vaccine field on COVID vaccine, on a rabies vaccine, which is in the clinics as well, and an oncology intratumoral, tumor-associated antigens, and then on the molecular therapeutic field as well. And then a part of this also upscaling our manufacturing. So this keeps us busy and also requires quite a lot of investment.